My dearest listener, today's message. Someone is unable to face you because of the intense guilt they feel. The angels say, somewhat recently, somebody you used to spend time with has dropped out of your life. You still see them now and then, but the two of you no longer connect the way you used to. They have stopped making the effort to be around you, and you may have even begun wondering if you did something wrong. I repeat, someone is unable to face you because of the intense guilt they feel. This loss of connection has stemmed from an argument the two of you had a bit back. To you, it was something small. You believe that the two of you moved past it no problem, and that nothing much has changed after it. To them, however, the argument was a much bigger deal. They consider it to have been a full-fledged fight, and they feel intensely guilty because of it. To them, nothing is the same as it once was. They struggle to believe things could just go back to normal after the argument you two had. They are convinced that you must see them differently now. Perhaps you do, but it hasn't been enough to majorly affect the relationship between the two of you in your eyes. To them, though, it's completely life-changing. To them, it has altered the entirety of your connection in a way they're afraid to put into words. This is the real reason they haven't been around. It isn't because of you beyond your part in the argument. It isn't because they no longer care for you or because they've grown tired of you. It is purely because they are afraid that you no longer feel the same way about them. Next time you see this person, try to have a meaningful conversation with them. Reach out to them if you don't already have plans to see them soon. Express what they mean to you. You don't have to address the argument at all. You don't have to address the way they've been feeling lately directly. It's enough for you to show them gentle reassurance for now. Further down the road, they may trust you with the truth of the situation. This will only happen if you are able to re-establish the trust between the two of you and begin to rebuild the relationship. They will apologize to you for their part in the argument and they'll tell you about their concerns, that they believed you wouldn't see them the same way and that your friendship was permanently damaged. If they do reveal these things to you, make sure you're gentle with them. They have had other negative experiences with people in the past to make them feel this way. It likely doesn't have anything to do with you specifically, so keep that in mind. Take a moment to allow all these words to resonate with your spirit. Remember, you are loved and protected by the universe. The stars have another message for you today, and it's one I felt you needed to hear. In the description of this video, there is a link to a special astrological reading. It's a divine message of guidance related to your moon sign and moon phase. This sign and phase of the moon at the exact moment of your birth reveals more about you than you could possibly imagine. Together, they influence your strengths and passions and reveal your potential for abundance, love and prosperity. I've heard you could use some extra wisdom to help with a very important decision coming up for you soon. And I have a strong premonition that the moon is going to deliver something incredibly valuable to you. And I want to be certain that you are well prepared because that moment is approaching very rapidly. Your soul is at a crossroads and you need to see which critical steps to take next. So. If you are ready to take the next step, check the link in the description for your free, personalized video moon reading to ensure the next step you take is leading you closer to abundance and prosperity. An important message is waiting for you in the next video. Will you hear it?